Kratz is going to show you how he plates one of his amazing signature dishes, a stunning chocolate pumpkin pie. Oh my gosh. Oh my if you don't mind, I could really use your help. I would love to. <laughs> yeah. I have wanted to see this dessert since I was in high school. I mean, it broke the internet for chefs. He takes food to a place of true art. I mean, the dude is genius. Basically, we created a chocolate shell. Yes. And we filled it with a frozen mousse of cranberry and dehydrated pumpkin pie. So we have some liquid nitrogen. No plates, out the window. Right, Wait. gone. This is so unbelievable. We're going to put some sauces down here so we have a vanilla-scented creme fraiche. Come on, Gordon, let's go. <laughs> this is a coffee reduction. Where did this idea come from? We said, why do we have to be confined to the dimensions of a plate? So we said, well, what can we make that would cover the entire table, like a painter on canvas? That creative freedom is really important. Next is passion fruit, giving it that nice acidic pop. And if you notice how our coffee is now turning square. Yeah. How? I don't know. A little magic there. This is some next level, next level stuff. This is like he and David Blaine got together and had a beer one night, and this dessert came out of it, you know? Mike, are you excited? My mind is currently blown, Chef. <laughs> next. So we have some maple syrup and butter spheres. Oh, oh my God. Strawberry scented cheesecake. These are coconut and turmeric. And then lastly, we have some citrus marigold petals that have been dusted in edible silver. What? That is so cool. Oh my gosh, this is like a Jackson Pollock. Are you ready for the finale? I'm excited, are you kidding me? OK, let's do it. You're about to break it. Cheers. Absolute pleasure. Oh, yeah! <laughs> That's so cool. All the rules are gone. All the limitations are gone. There are no rules tonight. That's from Grant himself, OK?